Hi everyone, this is Dr. Ashkovitz. I'm here with Sanjun Park. And this is Python authoring 16.10 kickoff video. Um, we'll start as always with the goals of the milestone. Um, the goal of the milestone is to continue to work uh, toward completing the CICD catalog that go to GA Epic. Primarily, we'll be focusing on three major items. Um, number one, supporting self-managed components. So we need to make sure we can support our self-managed customers with components that are available in the catalog on .com. So self-managed customer will be able to pull them quickly and easily. The second thing is semantic versioning. Uh, semantic versioning is a standard which we want to enforce when including components from the catalog. And lastly, there are uh, inputs enhancements that we want to uh, uh, that we want to implement uh, before we can move inputs uh, to GA. Those are all parts of the GA uh, epic for the CI/CD catalog. Along that, we have some UX improvements. Uh, on the details page and on the index page, uh, additional telemetry instrumentation, where we would like to understand uh, what are the, like how often a component is being used uh, and by, uh, by which organization. Um, and lastly, we do have some syntax improvement to support our existing customers uh, with the uh, popular feature request. And if you scroll down, you can see the list of the items that we have for deliverable and also uh, the workflow board, uh, which has all the items ordered by priority. With that, I'm going to pass it over to Sunjun Pat, and she is going to talk about the scope of work for UX. Take it away. Yep. Thanks, so. Let me reshare my screen. So, as Dope mentioned, we also have a lot of items as always, to work on, which is exciting. Um, and there are two issues that I wanted to mention. So the first one is the research problem validation research that I want to work with Joe to understand the needs like be behind the scene, because we also want to understand what is the need for the administrators who are maintaining the CICD catalog or CI components across their organization probably they have some preference to control those config and also want to have some power to make everything on the CSAD catalog secure and reliable. So we'd like to dig into this problem and then see what we can do for this type of users. So that's one big theme. And another big theme that we're starting to planning is to having a remote design sprint for the catalog project. And we are like discussing and starting to figure out the what's the best scope for the team. And it's still like almost refined, but the timeline wise, we want to use the last week of February to spend some time on the sync collaboration plus async collaboration so that all the team members can freely join and we can discuss and brainstorm together. So based on this activity, we will come up with a, a sort of design concept that could be easily validated with users. And as a next step, we could either do the solution validation or we could just start working on planning an implementation plan, but it really depends on the outcome. So I'm I'm very excited to see what's going on and what type what kind of discussion is happening during this design sprint. So that's one big theme. And before running the design sprint and Dove and I want to touch on like this is the second time that I'm running this competitor evaluation. So I named this like the part two and yeah, I'm not going to reveal all the details, but we kind of chose three different competitors that we want to touch on. And then we like to see like, like how the market competitiveness is going on so that we can also get some more insights from them. And yeah, the other design issue that I will work on is about like providing a filtering option to the batch. That means component will have sort of the level of batch. So this is GitLab maintain component. This is our partner maintain component. So yeah, we want to work on an option to filter those components by this information. Yeah, 
that was it. Do you want to add anything else, though? Yeah, maybe it's worth mentioning that both the activity on the design sprint and the problem validation are uh, aimed toward like our paid customers. That will be like paid features that we want to build on top of the of the catalog. Yeah, so there are more information for anyone who wants to review it on those issues themselves. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I forgot to mention the thanks for adding those details. And yeah, let me stop sharing. Yeah, thanks, everyone. Thank you.